Welcome back to the show. Now it's time for life lessons. Now there's been a lot of talk of creatives having to retrain. So I thought I'd ask the guys what job they thought they'd be brilliant at. A job that I secretly suspect that I would really be actually quite excellent at, but would never do, is a police officer. Fed. And I think deep down somewhere, I'm a massive snitch. <laughs> Sorry, Liz. Removal van man. I'll walk into someone's house and I will, I'll genuinely look in the living room and be like, that would get to the door, that would get to the door. You need to take that in half. <laughs> uh, 90 degree angle, 50 degree angle, that wouldn't get through the door. How did they get that in this house? Prime Minister, obviously. Prime Minister London, I'd sort it right out. Covid, psh, movid. Brexit, you're having a laugh. Nah, staying in. Everybody be great. Free margaritas on Thursday, wicked. This is hard because most stand-up comedians are comedians because they're not cut out for any other job. But a job I suspect I'd actually be great at is a teacher. I have this like romantic idea that I would be like Robin Williams and Dead Poet Society, just like, everyone get on your desks, rip up your textbooks, live, damn it. But I think I'd probably just be annoyed and every day would be a movie day. It's like, we're gonna watch another documentary because I made the wrong career choice. Doing pantomime for small children. Um, I will never do it only because I know once I get into that game that that's me for life. Because of my big personality, kids! <laughs> and it's a burden I wear every day. Detective. I think I'd be a really good detective. I really am good at wearing long coats and saying, get him out of here. A job I'd secretly be good at is chef. But I can't cook. A job I secretly suspect I'll be good at is a heart surgeon, um, because I think if it went wrong, I'd be OK with it. I wouldn't worry. I'd go, you know what, I'm not trained. 